friends welcome back to my channel today's video is about interjection which is the last part of speech you already know about these eight part, seven parts of speech and this is grief eight one so what is interjection will be known but let us say the names of the seven parts of speech. Noun, pronoun, verb, adjective, adverb, preposition, conjunction. And the last one is interjection. By this video, parts of speech session will be completed. So see, interjection. What is interjection? Interjection are words use it to express certain feelings or emotions they are words use it to express certain feelings certain feelings or emotions for example wow what a beautiful car hooray we won the match hooray we won the match and these all are the uh, expressions, certain feelings, their interjections. So let us start from types of interjections. Types of interjections. Okay. They are interjection of greetings, interjection of joy. Interjection of surprise, interjection of sorrow, interjection of approval, interjection of attention. These all are types of interjections. Okay. So we'll start with interjection of greeting. Interjection of greeting so what is interjection of greeting it is used to say hi hello hey these all are for interjection of greeting hi hello and one more fact is that Every, uh, every interjection will be followed by a exclamatory mark. I think you all know what is exclamatory mark. Which is this? Uh, this is the exclamatory mark. So friends, to say hi, hello, I said. But I will give you some examples also. Example. Hello, I am Tanishka. This is one type of interjection. Example of interjection for greeting. Hello, I am Tanishka. Next one is Hey, hey, nice to meet you here. Hey. Nice to Meet you here. Again, I want to recap. Interjection are words used to express. Used to express your certain feelings or emotions. What can it be for greetings? Greetings means not greeting cards. Greetings saying hi, hello, wishing happy birthday. These all are coming under greetings interjection for greeting and next next one will be surprise if you get a surprise how you react how you react to that surprise will come under interjection for surprise wow amazing these all come under interjection for surprise and next one will be what is next one joy joy uh, immediate joy and happiness 
to express immediate joy and happiness means saying hooray we won the match so let us start from joy only second one after greeting is joy i will again recap every part for this video at last joy joy to it is used to express what well, it is used to express it is used to express immediate joy and happiness that is uh, immediately if you won the match how do you react to that situation hooray i won the match hooray we won the match like this. if you get a surprise surprise is next one joy immediate joy and happiness that immediate one examples for that are hooray wow these both are examples and more examples but i'm giving you two examples hooray wow these are examples for interjection of joy so i'm giving you expression and i will give you the emoji also in the video so see here next hooray we won the match the first sentence is hooray i won the match or hooray we won the match we hooray we got the first prize and wow you are looking so beautiful wow you are looking so beautiful this is an example for uh interjection of joy and next one will be interjection of approval approval is nothing but expressing strong sense of approval or agreement for such something that happened means something that happened you are giving that approval you are giving that interjection to express strong sense of approval means you done some good thing and we are expressing it in type of approval interjection so let us see about that also approval to express that if you done a good thing how people react to yourself how well done brilliant bravo these are the three words commonly used and there will be so many well done bravo and brilliant these three are the common one so sentences examples are well done you won the race well done you won the race and uh, yep someone is giving that interjection feeling to you because it is an approval if you write an exam and you got 100 marks how will someone react to your situation this is that i'm saying to you okay and bravo the second rank is yours bravo the second rank is yours someone is saying you that you got the second rank and as well as he is reacting to that situation he is also saying bravo okay this is for interjection of approval and next one is interjection of attention interjection of attention it is used to draw attention of someone someone's attention you are going to draw it means you are going to uh, occupy not occupy you are going to draw attention of someone if he is seeing something you are going to call him or by shout you are going to make him to see this sight so what use it for this are look listen hush behold these words are used to look behold hush listen okay exclamation
exclamatory mark. Don't forget to give the exclamatory mark. Example. Look, you so arrogant. He is so the person is so arrogant, and you are drawing his attention to say that he is so arrogant. Look, you so arrogant. And behold, someone strange is there. See here, someone strange is there. So this is the sentence you are drawing his attention, drawing the person's attention to make that to see yourself okay and the last two are interjection of surprise and interjection of sort let's start with interjection of surprise interjection of surprise surprise to express to express strong sense of surprise just to express feelings for surprise. If you get a surprise or you give a surprise, how someone react? Or if anyone give you surprise, how you react? In what way you react? By what words you react is known in this sentence. So let me tell examples for that. How? How? You are expressing your surprise effect. What? What is this my house? This one. And hey, oh, ah. These are the examples. Ha, oh, ah. What? Examples are what? You failed. You got zero marks. What? You're using the exclamatory mark also. When you're expressing that you've got surprise at that, your friend has failed or someone has failed. What? You fail? There will be some reaction while you express interjection feeling. So I'm going to say you in that feeling only. Next one is, Ah, I got a new car's gift. Ah, I got a new car's gift. You got a new car gift and you will be so surprised and you don't know how to express the feeling in that situation. So, huh, wow, no. Ah, I got a new car as gift. Next one is interjection of sorrow. Sorrow. Sorrow is... Emotion of sadness, just to express this sadness emotion. Emotion of joy over, surprise over, approval over, attention, and there will be sadness left. No, let us finish that also. As, ouch, oh, ah, these all. Mischief also. Oops, oops. So, alas. He's too late. Help not too late. Sorry. Alas, he's no more. You're going to express sadness. Alas. Next is, ouch, it's so penny. Your leg has fractured or something happened. And how do you react to that? Ouch, it's so penny. You say like that. There will be some feeling on your face also in your moving senses also while you express the feelings okay so that's it this topic has finished and i said a recap interjections are words used to express certain feelings or emotions there are types of interjections they are interjection of greeting sorrow surprise attention approval getting a little back saying hi hello how are you this hi hello hey and next, approval. It is used to express strong sense of approval. That's how you react on someone. Examples for examples for that are well done, bravo, brilliant. And next joy, immediate joy and happiness. Hooray! Wow. And next is attention to draw attention of someone. Look, behold, this one. Surprise. Wow. What? This one. And sadness, alas, oops, oops, and uh, 
Ouch! Ouch! These all are the these all are the types of interjections. And I want to express this feeling now, this feeling also in interjection only. Hooray! We have completed this session of parts of speech. I also expressed this in hooray! Hooray! Okay, now next on words, we will start a new topic. So, interjections finish and let us recap all the parts of speech names once. Okay? What? Okay, stop. I'll give you all the names in the editing. Okay. Noun, pronoun, verb, adjective, adverb, preposition, conjunction, interjection. These all are the eight parts of speech and this session has completed. So friends, if you like this video, please like, share and subscribe and don't forget to comment and press the bell icon. Thank you for watching my channel, videos, whatever. Thank you for subscribing also and don't forget to see this short output. Thank you for watching. Take care. Bye. -bye. It's short out time. Short out is from Keyboard Melodies. Wow, you're a smart girl. Way to go, dear. Very useful for students. Like you did thoroughly. Keep up the good work and share with us. Thanks for sharing. Thank you so much, Keyboard Melodies, for your encouragement. Shout out is from Zach Me Shire. Nice, super video. Very informative. Thank you so much. Shout out is from Marisa Chalk. Hi, good video, dear friend. Thank you. Welcome Marisa Chok. Meet you in the next video.